What's up guys, T-Mart here, and this is huge. We are definitely going to be getting some sort of Call of Duty World War II information this weekend, and it could be as big as a full reveal trailer releasing tomorrow. Yes, you guys heard that right. We could be less than 24 hours away from the reveal of Call of Duty World War II. Now, before we get into this, I want to let you guys know that there are only a couple of days left on my three $50 Amazon gift card giveaway. You can buy any game you want or like a you know mouse or a keyboard or something like that with those things. So I just want to get back to you guys. If you guys want to check it out, I'll link it down in the description. You guys can go enter down there. But um, anyway, how do we find out about this? How do we know that this is coming this weekend? Well, IGN has a YouTube talk show called Game Scoop. And as the name implies, it talks about everything gaming and news and information, and all sorts of releases and reveals and stuff like that. And at the very end of today's episode, which came out just a couple of hours ago, they had a pretty serious teaser. Listen to it right here. Marty, is there any, there is some sort of, some sort of news that's coming this week about something? Yes. Uh, yeah, when, when, is, when do we go up? Well, this, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, this will be up. What's today? Wednesday? Yeah, so tomorrow. Okay, so over the weekend, we'll get some cool news, and there will be a big thing uh, happening next week, probably by the time we record this show, so we'll have a lot to talk about. All right, so it's pretty obvious that they're talking about something huge here, but how do we know it has to do with Call of Duty World War II? Well, this kind of opened the floodgates for other people to start talking. So the deal is, is that all of these industry people have this news super, super early. It's kind of the same as when Activision brings YouTubers out to record early gameplay so we can kind of pre-make videos and have them go live ahead of time to kind of let you guys know what the maps are like and stuff like that. It's the same deal for all of these news article sites and, and stuff like that. So they bring these people out, they have events where they get information, they see the game, they can pre-make their articles and stuff, and then they just can't talk about that until a specific date. They sign a contract called an NDA or a non-disclosure agreement, which is a legally binding contract that says you can't talk about it until this specific day and this specific time. And even though a lot of people sign those things, some people kind of like to push the boundaries a little bit. And I'm not sure if this is what's happening here or what's going on, but like for example, right here, this tweet from Jason Schreier, who's a news editor for Kotaku, one of the biggest gaming websites out there. Like this isn't just a random little website. He sarcastically tweets in response to this show, he bets it starts with a C and ends with an All of Duty World War II. So, you know, obviously there's some intel behind that tweet there. He obviously wouldn't say that otherwise. And then there are other websites like Player One TV, which personally I had never heard of before, but they're another gaming news site that puts out an article claiming that World War II will be officially unveiled by Activision and Sledgehammer Games on Friday, which is tomorrow. So again, this is a, a smaller one. I don't know if I trust that one quite as much, but I mean, people from all over, all the huge gaming sites are all talking about this right now. So uh, according to that Player One TV, the reveal's tomorrow, which I mean, it would totally make sense. It's Friday, you know, a lot of the game releases and news and stuff like that come out on Friday. It's the weekend, there are gonna be a lot of people online. Also throughout all the recent years, we've had huge reveals of the trailers during the NBA playoffs. Obviously the NBA playoffs are going Going on right now so Friday makes sense we could totally get a huge reveal trailer coming out tomorrow which would be insane or it could be something a little bit less that we get this weekend so Charlie Intel kind of emphasized that on the show they said it's gonna be cool news over the weekend and then a big thing happening next week so maybe they're gonna kind of stretch it out a little bit more maybe we'll get some sort of a teaser maybe a teaser trailer maybe just a teaser image or something like that this weekend and then the big reveal could happen next week I don't know but either way we are definitely gonna be getting something this weekend and we definitely should expect some sort of a reveal within the next like five days or so which is incredibly exciting i absolutely cannot wait i hope it's tomorrow i sincerely do but uh, we'll have to wait and see what happens so as soon as i hear more i'll be sure to let you guys know thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you guys think down in the comments peace out